I turned my toothbrush upside down and this what happened. I lost all my toothpaste. Aww. Good morning. My hair's all messed up. All the girls are in bed, but I decided to get out early. And I could not open this up. Like, it was crazy. I couldn't open it up. And I think, um, I don't know how big your case is all sticky, so maybe I'll try to figure out how to deal with that. Um, I can't really talk right now because it's silent. And I like the silence and I like the birds in the morning because it's like 6 o'clock in the morning. So I'm gonna uh, go now. <laughs> I'm mostly just filming between all the stages of my hair so I can see what it looks like in between. <laughs> By the way, the case is not sticky anymore. Don't know what that was. Um, so, <laughs> it's 9... 9.31. Uh, huh, huh, huh. Um, yeah, as you can tell by my hair, I fell asleep. I got home, I found this thing called Coffativity. And it's this really cool app that, uh, not app, it's a website, but I think they also have like an app for your computer. Um, where it plays, uh, the, like, the sound of a coffee shop in the background, like, some people talking, some, like, coffee in there, and it's very, it's extremely realistic, and apparently there have been studies saying that, like, two quiet things, two quiet places, like, lack creativity, and really loud places jumble up your mind, but, like, places that have a good balance of quiet and loud, like a coffee shop, um, really, really stimulate creativity. So what it is, is it's a constant playing, and you can play your music over it, and only a tiny bit over it, because, like, they even tell you, like, how much you should do, um, to make it more and more realistic. And, um, I basically just turned that on and, uh, went to sleep. I just fell asleep to the sound of it, because I don't know, I, it, was, it was calming. I liked it. But apparently it stimulates productivity as well as creativity. So, um... You can get you to do more stuff because I think it's like to alleviate the pressure of being productive, but also causing you to be productive. It's weird. It's I don't know. There there was a link to a study on it, and I don't know if it talked about that, but it might have, and perhaps. Uh, but I have also yet to eat dinner. I was supposed to, I was supposed to go to a concert tonight. It was um. It was the. It was a orchestra symphony thing playing music to this movie and I really wanted to go see it because it was kind of cool and I probably wouldn't have stayed for the whole thing but I still wanted to go see it but I ended up like I didn't I didn't not that I didn't feel good but I was really tired and as you can tell I'm not really clean I haven't taken a shower yet I was supposed to take a shower when I got home didn't do that um so I just I didn't really think that it was good to go so I didn't go and now I text my mom to see um, how long you've put clam chowder in the microwave for because I gotta do that. So I'm gonna go figure that out. <laughs> Bye. Big banana is big. He's tired. I'm tired. I barely got any sleep last night because I gotta help my girls with their things. But I mean, we actually had a decent night last night. Uh, the only time I ever had to help some girls out was when I was already awake. Um, granted, it was 5.30 in the morning, but I was already awake. <laughs> Oh, and good night. You just watched a vlog that Kira made. You followed her, but not in the creepy way. Maybe she stayed at home or went to school. Or went somewhere else and did something really cool. Cause she's crazy and she's silly and there's lots of weird friends. You'll hear this song after every vlog ends. Cause you just watched a vlog that Kira made. You can even subscribe.